Coach, you take on uh, Estacada on Friday night. Uh, they're, they're a football team. They, they run that full house backfield. They like to try and cram it down people's throats. Uh, uh, how have you guys been preparing for that? Well, uh, working a lot of different what we would call inside run sessions where we're really focusing on uh, on stopping the ball between the tackles and they'll use a lot of two tight end sets so um, you know the adjustments we'll want to make uh, with that formation um, you know and, and really it's becomes uh, fundamental football so you have to be able to, to have great pad level in football in some ways it's kind of easy the low man normally wins so uh, we've been working a lot of that and just trying to get off blocks and, and find the football and get to it and, uh, if we do those things Friday night we'll have a chance Almost two full weeks of practice now in the books for the fishermen. What's it been like? I know some young guys at the start, but they've gotten a lot of reps, and, and certainly they've grown up in a hurry. Yeah, absolutely, and I think in that regard it's been surprisingly very good. Uh, we've consistently been better every time out. Um, we had a great uh, last full padded session getting ready for Estacada. Um, and so we're enthusiastic, we're optimistic, and uh, we feel real good about uh, you know the direction we're headed different look uh, in the backfield you're actually going to play both quarterbacks uh, at once J Jacob Davis and Connor Harbor and, and that may create some uh, some uh, matchup troubles for other teams yeah that's what we're hoping we'll, we'll probably use uh, you know as commonly referred to as uh, that pistol look where you're still in a shotgun formation when the running back is directly behind the quarterback um, and we essentially have two quarterbacks back there so we think that creates a lot of flexibility for us and and may create some some uh, uh, matchup nightmares for, for other teams and, and keep some defense coordinators up late at night. So that's certainly what we're hoping for, and uh, uh, we'll see how it goes.